We will now prepare TDS return using TDS man. We will first create our company. Click on add to create a new company. Now enter the company details. To save the record, click on save. If you have other companies, you can add them in the similar way. Click on cancel to go back. Companies entered will get listed over here. Click on exit to close this module. Now, we will create one regular return. Select your relevant TDS form. Select the relevant financial year, quarter and company to generate the return. Now, we will add Chalan and Dedicti records pertaining to this return. First, we will enter the Chalan as we have submitted it. Fill in the details as mentioned in the Chalan copy. Click here to save the record. In the similar way, other Chalans of this return can be added. To add Dedictees, select its Chalan. Click on Dedicti Details button. This shows the Chalan that we have selected. Enter the details of the payments made to the Dedictees. Click here to save the record. Other Dedictees can be added in the similar way. To enter the details of the Dedictees against the other Cholans, go back to the Chalan screen and select the relevant Chalan. To enter the Dedicti details click on Dedicti details. Enter the Dedicti details. Similarly, all the Chalan and the respective Dedicti details can be entered. After all the entries are complete, we can proceed to create the TDS return. Enter the token number of the last return. Summary of the records entered is displayed here. Click here to go to Generate Return section. Click here to generate the text file. Click here to create the FVU file. Enter the CAPTCHA code. This message confirms the TDS return file creation. This is Form 27A. This has to be printed and signed. This is the FVU file of the return. Copy this on a CD or a pen drive for submission. This completes our preparation for TDS return. Click here to go back to the main screen. Thanks for your time.
Hope you found it useful.